This is not clickbait. I really did buy and acquire a pressure washing company here in my city. What is going on guys? Austin Davis. Welcome back to my channel. I'm making a really cool and sweet, quick video for you guys. Once again, I just want to give you guys a little update. Um, I'm having the busiest pressure washing week in my life right now, starting today. Over the next seven days, it's just going to be an epic amount of videos. Uh, really, really cool stuff coming on the channel recently. But the point of this video is, yes, if you're following me on Instagram, following me on Instagram, excuse me, Austin underscore Davis 23, you might have seen where I posted about me acquiring a pressure washing company in my city. And yes, that is true. I did acquire Clean Time Soft Wash up in North Austin. Really, really great and reputable company out in the North Austin area. A little over 80 reviews on Google, uh, over two years in the business, uh, 125 grand worth of gross revenue last year. Um, and I was able to acquire that I'm not going to disclose the price I was able to acquire that for um, that's not y'all's business but um, that being said I did acquire business uh, it's a guy that actually started his business two years ago and he was actually watching my videos he's from Houston he came to Austin was watching some of my videos learned a lot about pressure washing from myself and a couple other people in the business um, I met up with him then all of a sudden you know he was wanting bleach about a year ago he was asking hey Austin where can I get some bleach I'm moving here from Houston and I said man you can buy it from me because we sell bleach in Austin Texas I would see him come in to get bleach all the freaking time and I was always asking him like man how are you how are you getting your jobs you know this and that and he's like man like a I've been going door to door, just straight hustling and making friends and getting people to uh, leave reviews on Facebook and next door. And that's pretty much his thing. And he was like one of the best salespeople I've ever seen. I, I, I witnessed him go door to door a few times and the guy's just a straight killer. So grew his business really, really quick. So that's pretty cool. He's a huge book of business. So I'm pretty much buying his website, his book of business, all of his you know previous clients, uh, his online presence, obviously, and his phone number. So I acquired all that. There's not really any, he's a one man show. So obviously I'm just absorbing his business. I'm not acquiring any employees I'm not uh, acquiring any equipment he had equipment but I don't need the, that equipment I have my own equipment so I bought the book of business the website the Google my business phone number and all the clients and stuff and plus everything that he had on the schedule at that point in time so I mean with my business doing 155 grand last year and his is doing about 125 in the last 12 months so theoretically um, if we can even do get all the jobs done from leads from both companies we should fall around 300 grand for this year I'm hoping um, but assuming that we have some some growth which we already have for my company at least as far as the last two months is concerned we should be going above the 300 grand mark that's what I'm gonna be hoping for this year but in order to accomplish that I need freaking manpower so that's kind of what I'm uh, gonna be struggling with the next uh, few weeks is uh, hiring people because um, that's my next step guys you guys know that I've been on the truck for the last four years if you guys have been following me ever since the beginning of my channel I've come a long way I had my wooden skid that I had pan built myself going out there door knocking hustling flyers yard signs I talked all about about it went through the struggles of my first two years then I got my skid then I you know I worked that whole skid for a whole year and a half then I got my trailer that I have now and even before my channel you guys never even saw what I first rocked with I rocked with my dad's old truck that I leased from him because he's old school and he wouldn't just let me use it I think I gave him a thousand bucks for it was like 200 bucks a month for like six months or like a year and I paid him up front for the, for the lease and I threw my four gallon per minutes in the back there I'll show some pictures if I have something right here um, um, but just absolute hustling guys and it's crazy that it wasn't that long ago about a year ago maybe six months to a year ago where I got approached for someone to buy me out and I didn't really talk about it on YouTube because it was something that I was halfway considering but also exploring because I was like mm, let's see what you know what if I did sell it what could it be out there for me right because um, I mean you guys know this is not something I want to do forever um, I see pressure washing as a vehicle um, and a sellable asset to, to pretty much launch my you know my, my life even further you know who knows what kind of opportunities I have coming my way you know with real estate and obviously YouTube so uh, I was pondering it at the time but ultimately I kind of backed out because I was like man I just don't know if I want to sell my business like I'm do I'm making really good money right now I I should just keep writing it out and like thank god i didn't because I, I had a legitimate offer on the table that was pretty attractive to me and i still i turned it down and now i'm looking back at it and i'm you know my mother my friends my, you know my dad they're saying austin thank god you didn't do that you kept on you know doing what you're doing and here you are we have a new business right um and i was able to acquire another one just super grateful so i just wanted to give you guys a quick update on you know what's going on because i know if you guys are following me on facebook and instagram i got a lot of messages like what the heck and yeah it's true 
So I'm still over here trying to process it. Uh, Clean Time Soft Wash, great company. I have all the shirts. And uh, yeah, so right now I'm just gonna kinda get through the tri trials and tribulations of uh, hiring. So that's just the quick update for you guys. Going forward, expect this month to be probably the craziest pressure washing month ever. And this week, I'm making a video of a whole week's worth of pressure washing because this week is going to be the craziest amount of revenue that's coming into my business right now, especially with the other business that I just acquired. And <laughs> I'm gonna be working my absolute tail off for the next uh, weeks, a couple weeks. So that is just the quick update for you guys. Um, if y'all have been watching me since my inception, since the beginning of time, I really want to say thank you for staying along and just following me and supporting me, asking questions, hopping on coaching calls with me, being in my corner, texting me, all the love, the letters, the things I got in the mail, um, just all the love and support for you guys. I just can't, <laughs> man, I tell you what, two years ago when I started my channel and when I really got ramped up in my business, or it was like two and a half years ago I started my channel and I was getting, I was starting to get ramped up in my business. I just built my home built skid. I could not think at that particular time I was gonna be right here. You know, the pressure washing thing was something I wasn't, I was still kind of unsure about, but just the growth in the last two years and to have this opportunity to buy this business has just been something that I could not even think of. I just, it was something that I just can't even wrap my, around, my mind around. And now I'm left with the task, you know, handling this in the most responsible way possible and the most efficient way possible and doing things the correct way. You know, I still have to, you know, figure out how I'm gonna hire people, um, get people involved. First thing I probably wanna do is hire a full-time window cleaner because Clean Time Soft Wash is a, pri a primarily a window cleaning company. They do do a lot of pressure washing, but they get a lot of phone calls for window cleaning. They pretty much own window cleaning um, in North Austin areas. I got a lot of work to do, um, but stay tuned. This week, I'm having the busiest pressure washing week ever. Um, I got a bank I'm doing tomorrow. We're doing uh, an apartment complex. I believe we're doing a student living building, which is a five-story building. And I think I have seven, nine or 10 house washing and window cleanings all in the next two weeks. So stay tuned for the ride. So let's stay tuned for the ride. If you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button because you're not gonna wanna miss out the whole month's worth of content that's coming. Absolutely epic. We're gonna have the most epic summer ever. So let's get out there and let's go crush it. Peace out.